YouTube, what's going on? Kevin the Tech Ninja here, and if this is your first time seeing my face this year, happy new year. We're gonna start the year off with a bang talking about smart home. In today's video, we're taking a look at some smart home tech from Wiz and Leviton, and a big thanks to Home Depot for sponsoring a smarter home. Let's get into it. One of the easiest ways to make your home smarter is by getting smart bulbs. It doesn't require any tools, any installations, you just screw it in. But a lot of people don't make the plunge because a lot of times getting into smart bulbs is pretty expensive as a lot of them require hubs for them to communicate to your network. These bulbs are from Wiz and in front of you, there is the A19 bulb and the BR30. The A19 bulbs retails for $35 and the BR30 runs for $40. It connects with Google Home and also Amazon Echo. To get started, you just screw the light in, install the application, and then walk through the steps within the app. The app is pretty self-explanatory. Everything is laid out in this nice interface. It gives you the option to change colors, brightness, right from the main screen. Also in the app, you have the option to set schedules, timers, and these lights connect to the cloud, giving you access when you're out of the house. Overall, these bulbs are cheaper than the competition because they don't have a hub, and they actually work very well too. They're LED bulbs, meaning they'll last a long time and they don't emit any type of additional heat. So if you wanna check out some smart bulbs, take your butt down to the Home Depot or hit my link down below to pick them up. Staying on the theme of lighting, we're moving over to Leviton and their smart dimmer with HomeKit technology. Meaning if you have an iPhone or an iPad in your house, you can use these bulbs natively within the phone. You don't have to install an extra application or anything like that and it also works with Siri. And then from any time, you can tell Siri to turn off the lights or turn on the lights. Turn off the lights. This is also compatible with the Decora Smart Home app for iOS, but since it integrates into HomeKit, it's not required, it's all baked into iOS. On Android, you have My Leviton app, which is a little behind the iOS version. It gives you basic functionality of triggering the lights off and on, but it has integration to Google Home and Amazon Alexa using the Leviton skill. Lastly, we're gonna take a look at one more product and this one is from Leviton as well. And this is a duplex type A and type C USB plug. I found these to be extremely useful, especially in the kitchen when I wanna just plug my phone in really quick and I don't have to look for the brick, I just plug my phone directly into the wall. So any modern day smartphone, iPad or iMac will plug right into this USB-C port. And although it may not be certified as quick charge, it does have a faster charge than plugging into a laptop or plugging into a non-supported charger. Even before this video, I had these switches in my house and I just like having the ability to just plug something into the wall as quick as possible. And USB-C is becoming the standard of a lot of things. Headphones are USB-C now and phones are USB-C. It just makes more sense to just be able to plug it in directly without having a bulky adapter with it. And installation for these things is pretty simple, but if you're not comfortable, I do recommend getting an electrician or a professional to come out to get it installed. Regardless, this is a very inexpensive way to just sort of update your house with the newest plug technology. Anyways, guys, I'd love to hear from you. What type of smart home tech are you rocking in your house? Did you pick up anything from my list? Let me know down below. Anyways, guys, Kevin the Tech Ninja here signing off for a smarter home. Talk to you guys later. Peace.